Welcome to the substation construction video. All workers and visitors in the construction site should wear the appropriate PPE to reduce exposure to various hazards on the work site. Safety signs should be placed appropriately around the site to warn and raise health and safety awareness for employees and visitors. First, the construction equipment were to be transported to the construction site. Then a trench excavation is to be performed around the designated construction site location. An excavator will be used for digging the trench. Once the trench is done excavating, set up ground wire and electrical cable in the trench. After setting up the wiring, backfill the trench with construction equipment such as loader and shovel. Then level the excavated area by replacing topsoil to the trench. Put up fences around the construction site after the leveling is done. We first dig a hole on ground level, place frame and add fill, lay rebar for the concrete slab. Then, by utilizing concrete mixer and concrete pump, we mix and pour concrete to the designated area. Once the concrete is cured, remove the formwork. Continuous Flight Auger Piling Construction Method, also known as CFA, is a fast and economic piling method ideally suited to wet or granular ground conditions. A CFA pile has an auger that spins and drill through the ground to the required depth. After drilling is done, the concrete mixer would pour cement into the pump and through a hose connected to the hollow stem of the auger. Concrete is pumped under pressure into the ground while the auger is withdrawn, carrying the excavated soil upwards. Then a reinforcement is to be placed before the concrete pile dried up. The accumulated soil is then cleared away by the compact loader. Repeat the process and prepare the concrete foundations for the girder beams. A ground rod is a long metal rod driven into the ground to provide a path for electrical current to disperse into the earth. A grounding rod helps to prevent the dangers associated with static discharge voltages such as lightning thereby reducing the risk of harm during storms. Put the transformer in place carefully. Then you should disable the main power supply by using lockout tag procedures. With the steel beams in position, secure the beams with clamps and bolts to connect him to the foundation piles. Set up circuits and transmission line to the gantry structures. Connect necessary equipment. Laying a high-resistivity surface material like gravel in substation to increase the allowable step and touch voltages. 